I'm gonna be shot before I die from an earthquake or from the quake. I have a psychotic neighbor. <laughs> Say, we're fine. We're fine. No problem. <laughs> earthquake drill, are you ready? Beep, 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 earthquake, earthquake, where are you gonna go? Smart, Xander, now scoot over and grab Kenya, grab your baby sister. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry. Okay. You're gonna be just fine, Don. okay? You're gonna be okay, it's grass. You are traumatizing. Okay, you are watching The Boy Family Juice. Hallelujah! You guys, we just had a 5.7 earthquake here in Utah. I'm at the grocery store and they are handing out some of the toilet paper, which is smart. Everyone is panicking more than we already were. <laughs> Guess what, everybody? I'm gonna be shot before I die from an earthquake or from the quake. I have a psychotic neighbor <laughs> who's gonna murder me before I die from, from some natural disaster. Oh my gosh. That's just what we need is more panic. I went and got gas in the car. The car everybody's lining up for gas. I was sitting there nursing my baby peacefully in my bed. And there's an earthquake and my bed is just shaking and waving and my boys come in. Oh, that was scary. Oh my gosh. Anyway. <sighs> what else do I need? You guys, I mean, we've got lightning and earthquakes and rain and a pandemic and a psycho neighbor say, we're fine. <laughs> Say no problem. No problem. <laughs> I tell her what to tell myself. Because <laughs> I have to hear it from someone else, you know? So, I know you can push it too. She wants to push the button there. We are going into the, she wants to wait for it to close. Going into workout and let these kids play basketball and just pretend like everything's normal. Okay, so it was a 5.7. The, the, the city is kind of panicking. I know, I'm gonna go get, no, just stay in here. Got the kids playing in here. Okay, I'll go get you a ball, okay? And um, I'm just trying to keep calm. As long as I'm calm, my kids are calm. All right, say the words. Because I have a brother, I will always have a friend. Let's hear it. That's right. I knew that wasn't gonna last. They're in time out here at the Life Center. In this bag and this toilet paper in a bag. Okay, Xander, go get me five diapers for Kenya and five diapers for the baby. Okay. Putting formula in the bag too. Um, we just had a warning to take all of our cars out of the garages and to put emergency kits in our cars because there's a potential larger earthquake within the next two hours. So. I'm just trying to stay calm for these kids and I'm doing great, but I'm just preparing and putting stuff in the car. Okay, I got water. <laughs> no, I don't have a ton of bottled water. And toilet paper and some snacks. Formula, just in case, you just never know. So I'm just a little bit worried about this dude. Is he gonna come up, pull out a gun and just shoot me for my toilet paper or something? This is awesome. It's fine, it's fine. Fine. An earthquake drill, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, pretend you're playing. Go and play. And when I scream earthquake, I want you guys to go tell me what you're gonna do. Go play, Trey Trey, just pretend. Oh, they're playing, ha ha, fun. Beep, 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 earthquake, earthquake. Where are you gonna go? Where are you gonna go? Smart, Xander, smart. Where are you gonna go, Ari? Where the heck is Ari going? No, 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 don't go under your bed. Come here. Remember under the table where I showed you? Good, Trey, yeah. right under there. Yes, get right under there. Hide your legs, hide your feet. Kenya, come here. Come hide, Kenya. Move the chairs out of the way, bud. The chairs aren't gonna help you. You gotta move the chairs out of the way, okay? There we go. Kenya, go hide. Run, go hide. Go hide. There's Xander. I got my girls babysitting my sister's kids because she had a, a hospital appointment. Go hide, Kenya. Move the chairs, guys. Just go like this and move them. Move them out of the way. Now scoot over and grab Kenya. Grab your baby sister. Grab your baby sister and protect her, okay? Good job, and you hide under that table. Nice, Xander. And you just stay right there, huh? Oh my gosh. These cars are out in the garage, out of their garages. 
Right, we just moved all of these boxes and bins out of here so that nothing will fall on him when he sleeps. Oh my gosh, look what I just found. Hmm. I didn't even know that this was here. It's like a lifetime ago. My two-year-old that rarely has temper tantrums is having a temper tantrum. She can probably feel the stress. And believe me, people, I'm doing a great job, if I do say so myself, of being calm. Because I know it's not going to do anybody any favors if I freak out. Okay, let me see you breathe like this. Can you breathe? Okay, blow out. Blow. Wait, Poor Dana is crying because the ball once again went in there. Don't worry, Dana. Dana, Dana, it is not your fault. You didn't do anything wrong. You know, don't worry, we're just going to get this on camera so that we have it. It's okay. Everything's fine. Don't even sweat. Don't sweat it. It's okay. Don't worry, okay? It's not your fault. He is just not. Okay. Oh, I know, I know. Don't worry. Ari, get off of his grass. Thank you. Please don't touch his grass. Go on. Okay, go ahead. It's okay. You're going to be fine. You're going to be just fine, Don. Okay? You're going to be okay. It's grass. You are traumatized. It's okay. Just go. Go play. Go shake it off. Go run. Okay? You guys know, you guys know how not to be when you grow up. One of my blessed neighbors called. Oh my gosh. He's crazy. He's a loose cannon, you guys. Oh my gosh, who called? I'm dying to know. I gotta text my neighbors. Here we go again. I think they're stepping aside somewhere. Hold on. So it was Don that called, just trying to get back at us. He's just sitting there, just listening in, just waiting. Like this. this is a joke, you guys. He's crazy. So it was him that called. Bless his sweet soul. And I'm freezing. The cops are like, oh, you know, all you can do is what you can do. He's mad, he's angry. There's no one that could put a smile on that guy's face. We just had to have a little powwow with them all, and unfortunately, we're gonna have to play in the circle. Um, oh my god! They can't play in the circle. Yeah. Unintended. Unfortunately, no we're balls gonna have in the to move. What? Oh unfortunately, god. Dad said we have to move because uh, if Dawn doesn't be mean to us anymore. Yeah, he's not a kind person. So, um, I'm sure he's just saying a bunch of lies right now because he's like, ah, he's come over here multiple times aggressively. I'm like. Multiple times? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Whatever yeah, you say. It's true. So, anyway, now they're kind of, he, the cops are being our mediators and saying, okay, now what? where can they go, Don? If the ball goes on your driveway, are they allowed to go get it, the ball off of your driveway? Are they allowed to get the ball if it goes it on hey, your grass? But he was did you see me? Yep. Look at me. Look at me. No balls in his in the circle anymore. If you don't get the balls, you go outside. But he was going to keep the ball. He said he wants to yeah, keep he said it. Yeah. So the ball went over there, and Alex said, "Can I? You know, can you please give us the ball?" And he said, "No. As a matter of fact, I'm not going to give you the ball." So I'm going to play myself. Probably. Yeah. Idiot. <laughs> That's the dumbest, childish thing I've ever seen. It in my is. Life. He's like he's got mental problems. <laughs> He has got mental problems. That's why he's alone, you guys. Okay? We just pray for our enemies. Great voices. Bringing us a little bit of peace and calm. He's still, he's still fighting for it. Uh, I'm losing my mind. 
I haven't put purple lipstick on because I feel insane. Yeah, I'm sure your feet are cold. My freaking kids have put swimming suits on. I don't know if you can see them. And they are, they put the hose on the tramp. Like I'm like, go ahead and freeze. Now they're freezing and I'm not letting them in the house because I'm like, are you serious? Yep, thank you. Are you freaking kidding me? I just had chocolate milk spill everywhere. I've got neighbors calling to check on me. I haven't uploaded anything today. That's why they're always late at night. That's why you guys get the uploads late because I can't even get it during the day. I can't even take a minute. I have a smoothie sitting here waiting to blend, but I haven't had a chance to even feed myself. This homeschool thing, like, this is my worst nightmare. You guys, I'm never gonna survive. Like, there's too many people online, so. Now my system is just crashing and the internet isn't working. And I just heard that it's a myth to stand in the doorway. I'm like, oh great. <laughs> Cause that's what we used to do. Like that's what we, what we, what we learned when we were little. And it's like already 3.30. And I've done nothing productive today but get yelled at by neighbors. Hi guys. Um, it's been kind of a crazy day because um, of the police and the earthquakes and corona, everything. I got a sweet gift from someone, but I don't need, I got one of these really huge kisses and this note. So thank you to anyone who gave it to me because I, I don't know, I, my sister, ans India answered before me, so I didn't see who it was. Anyways, it's been just crazy times and yeah. So I'll see you guys later. Good luck. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> You guys, I'm laying down. I don't get headaches very often, which is such a blessing, but I have a headache. I'm obviously physically under stress for it to be happening. Oh, it's easy. I need some baby laughs for a minute.